Hi guys, Spartan here. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can back up and restore your computer using Macrium Reflect, which is the best uh, program for backing up and restoring uh, computers. Now, I don't, I don't personally like to install it on my computer just because I like to keep things as light as possible without any background services running. So what I do is I create a Macrium Reflect rescue disk, which I can boot off create backups or restore my computer if I needed to go back to a particular you know, image that I created before. So um, what I have here is I have a six, uh, I have a 128 gigabyte uh, Patriot Supersonic Rage 2 flash disk. It's one of the very, I mean, it's one of the fastest flash disks out there. I'll, I'll put a link in the description in case you wanted to get one of those, but really you can use any fast flash disk if you want. Just don't get a slow one because it's just going to take ages to, uh, you know, back up or restore. So first thing I want to do here is I'm going to wipe the USB, the current USB flash disk just to show you. I'm going to launch PowerShell or Command Prompt, whichever one you prefer. Then type in disk part and hit enter. Then you want to type list disk and hit enter. So I get a, a list of all the connected drives right now. and, and my flash disk is this one at the end here, it says 115 GB. So I'm going to type select disk 5. Now what I want to do is I want to hit clean and hit enter. Sorry, type clean and hit enter. And it's wiped. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create a current uh, formatted really basically. I'm going to go to disk management. And I'm going to create a new volume. I'll just type R for rescue. So that is XFAT. And name it rescue. Now, I didn't care to partition it at this point because when I create the Macrium Reflect bootable drive using a program called Grufus, it's going to create, it's going to format it anyway and create a single partition. So I'll show you how we can split that late in, in, in momentarily. So now that we have the disk, what we want to do is we want to launch Grufus. That's how we pronounce it. And it already, oh, here we go. So it's, it, this is, you want to select the flash disk, which you want to work on. So we named it rescue. Leave everything as default here. Just hit select to locate the ISO where the ISO is, which I also link it in the description. So we're going to go to this folder here. And this is the file that we want, Macrium Rescue. Now the label's already selected. All I'm going to do is hit start. And it's going to format it as FAT32 to make it, you know, compatible with most computers for boot up. And then this should take about a minute to complete. All right, so it's complete. I'll hit close. Now, this rescue disk here, this is a, a bootable flash disk. So you can just, you know, restart your computer and boot off it. And you'll be introduced with the Macrum Reflect interface that we all know. I'll also put a link in the description to a, a little tutorial of how to use Macrium Reflect, how to back up and how to restore, just in case. So now that we have a single disk, but we're not going to be able to back up or create an image of my drives on the same disk because this is the bootable media. It, it, it has to be on a separate partition. So what I want to do is I'm going to split this you can use your, you know, any any uh, partition manager. What I'm what I'm what I'm using here is MIDI Tool Partition Wizard. Right. So let's see. This is the flash disk that we want to create. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do split. And here I'm going to just type one zero two four.
and the rest. The second partition, you want to format it as NTFS, not FAT32. The reason is the images are too large for a FAT32 partition, so we want to make that NTFS. And we're going to call this image. Now we're going to hit apply. Right, so this is done. I can close the program, and what we have now is the bootable drive and the image. It's the same heart, the flash disk, but it's a it's a bootable one. Now, if you want to get fancy, you can uh, put your little icon here if you want to make it stand out. So I'm gonna go grab these. Put this here. There we go. And as you see, the icon has been uh, added, and this is the bootable drive. So simply restart your computer, boot off of the flash disk. If it's a uh, Dell or Alienware, it's, you hit the F12 key to get the boot options, and you'll be introduced with the Macro Reflect interface to start a backup or a restoration. Be sure to check out my guide on Macro Reflect, which I'll link in the description, so that you have an, a better idea of how to backup and restore your computer. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.